Oh, the one last thing that uh, I should go over is, so all of you have your exam back. You should have been going through the self-grading. Um, and I had some email questions about how to grade a particular question. I'm happy to answer those as long as you know it's not grade your entire exam for you. So you know some of the cases will be difficult because it, it's, uh, um, it, it's the kind of question where I myself would have taken a few minutes to decide whether it's going to be a five or four. Is it going to be four or three? So that's why I am providing this anchor paper to give you some guidance. But I realize this won't answer every single question. So as you're grading, if anything's not clear, email me. I can answer it. You have until, I guess, one week from today to finish your self-grading. So um, get to it soon. Uh, preferably do it over this weekend so that you can clear up any questions. So I had two turned in. I returned the one, you know, finished everything. It, it turned out great. Um, one, I actually will be returning it, but I didn't enter the grades because the person didn't quite do it correctly. Um, so with the self-grading, I guess if you're turning it in, whatever you turn it on Thursday is going to be the final version. But um, if you turn it in earlier, then I do have an opportunity to give you time to redo some parts of it. Because um, that's, I think, one positive aspect of the self-grading. Uh, whatever you had to do during the exam time has already been done. It's already scanned it. That part is set in stone, and I can um, and the rest of it can work more like a, 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 I guess, regular assignment, like a paper in an English class where you have multiple drafts. Um, not that I don't, I don't think it will be necessary for most people, but if, if it does turn, turn out to be necessary, and that's one reason to turn this in earlier rather than wait all the way until Thursday, because whatever you turn in on Thursday, that will be final. Yeah. All right, so if you have it done already today, turn it in at the end of the lecture. Um, Otherwise, you know, uh, if you want some kind of feedback, try turning it in on Tuesday or whatever you turn it on Thursday will determine your meta grade, the three points that you can potentially get. Um, and I guess while I'm saying it, I'll say what was wrong with this one that I'm going to give back to the person without having entered the grade is um, they didn't uh, uh, make all the uh, correcting marks. Like there are some questions they essentially skipped, and they in the grading they also left it essentially blank. In that case, for the meta grade, you get um, I guess one out of three, so correctly assigning the correct score. But if you want anything more than that, you have to show an understanding of the solution. So it wouldn't mean that you are just copying from the posted solution. Mm -hmm. It wouldn't mean that you read it, you try to understand it, and then you wrote down a version of version that shows your understanding. Yeah. 